are inside Arrowhead Stadium here in Kansas City. The scene a few moments ago, here it is. It's unlike any other in sport as both teams made their way out of the tunnel. These folks are fired up as their guys are ready to do battle with the Washington football team. Well, we thought this could get interesting. Here's interesting, an onside kick to start this thing. And this is going to be covered up by Washington. Well, they tried to give this home crowd something to cheer about early, but it failed. I don't know. Maybe you try that on the road to get some momentum. What about here at home? Would agree with you totally on that. I think at home, you don't ever want to put your fans in a position where they're questioning what you're doing. And right now, they have to be in the stand saying, why would we even do that? We're already behind you. You don't need us anymore. And this one, boy, an unsuccessful attempt. That could really change the momentum of this game in a hurry. And he's able to carve out about six there, down to the 37. On the tackle. Second down and four. Pickup brings up second and four at the 37-yard line. Now Haskins. And that one got tipped, kind of threw everything off. It brings up third for Steven Sims. So much of this game is about leverage. We always talk about low man wins in the trenches. Plus like that at just about every position. And sometimes if you lose that leverage and you're losing the battle, just jump up at the line of scrimmage and try and bat the ball away. And that's exactly what happened there. And he's going to be taken down here, still a couple yards short of the first. Just a gain of two there, and it's going to bring up a fourth down. A gain of two yards on the play. Brings up fourth down. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Complete the conversion Stevens is successful with a sizable a gain of 13, 13 and the decision to go for it looks like a smart one. First down, here's a run with Peterson. Five yards is the tally on first down. That brings up second and five. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback, and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. A first carry for the converted wideout, J.D. McKissick. And he'll get four there down to about the 12-yard line. Ball carrier. Not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run-pass option. You get the sense the next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? First carry for Peyton Barber. And he will have the first down inside the 10 to the 9-yard line. And they got three yards. That's enough. A conversion, and now it's first and goal. So first and goal from the 9-yard line. Here's Barber. And a nice pick up there. He gets about five down to the four-yard line. He was brought down. Decided to hand it off that time on the run-pass option. Appeared to be an easy decision. Just gave it inside. Nice steady gain. Second and goal from inside the five. Shotgun handoff now for Love. And he'll take this into the end zone. Touchdown, Washington. Washington. Taking it in from four yards out. And Washington has taken a first quarter lead. It's good, and Washington will take a 7-0 lead. Washington, 7. Chiefs, nothing. Out is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. Here's me, Cole Hardman. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. The Chiefs take over first and 10 at their own 34-yard line. will lead the Chiefs up first and 10 at the 34. He'll throw from the gun. And this will be incomplete. 
physical play on the football there, and it's second down. Nice play there to force the incompletion. And to me, one thing's for sure. When you're the underdogs and you're playing on the road, you absolutely have to get takeaways. You've got to get the ball from them. Yeah, win that turnover battle going to be key. They didn't get one there, but you get the feeling they keep making plays like that. They might just get a few. Yeah, once you get one, defensive teams think they come in bunches. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has them staring at a third and ten. Working from the gun, Mahomes. It's Williams on the catch. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. Give him 13 yards there and a Kansas City first down. Now it's Mahomes again. This one complete to Miko Hardman. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight, second and two. Facing a second and two after that last catch, good for eight yards. At the 45-yard line. Flushed out right. He's going to take off with it. And he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. Oh. Offensively, they like their situation, so they tried to take a shot downfield, but no one was open. So it was tucking in run time, and he picks up a first down. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Going to let one fly for Robinson. And he will take it on in for the Chiefs touchdown. Demarcus Robinson, 39 yards. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying up this football game. Andy Reid never wanted to shy away from taking chances. He'll go for two. Here's Mahomes to throw. And he cannot avoid the pressure as the Washington pass rush gets home. Boy, a little panic here early. A first quarter onside kick. And they've got it. They recovered it. They hang on now, though. There's a penalty flag down. So they touched it before it went 10, and that's obviously not going to help their comeback bid here in the fourth. No, not at all. And they're trying to get something going, going after one there. But you've got to give yourself a chance. Let it go 10 before you touch it. And a solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves them with a second and three. Well, no matter how they phrase it, staying on schedule, staying ahead of the sticks, whatever you want to call it, seven yards. Second down and three. Now it's AP, Adrian Peterson. Looking for a crease, can't find one. Stopped at the line of scrimmage. Call it no gain that time as it's going to leave him with a third and about three to go. Third down. Here's Haskins out of the gun. Slings this deep from McLaurin. And oh, it'll be intercepted. Tedrick Thompson picks it. And nothing there on the return. They've got the football, but they'll have to start this drive at their own four-yard line. Oh, and that's a nice job defensively to get a piece of the football. He's going to pop it into the air, and then it's the tip drill. And good concentration by him to react to it and pull in the interception. But now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. The one with a dime looked on defense. Two extra defensive backs on the field and covered up essentially every blade of grass. That allowed them to disrupt the play. Now a pass that's taken in by Hill. And he'll go out of bounds just shy of the 20. 15 yards on the play, first down. Well, I think we got evidence right now that this team's not going to be daunted at all. Just because they're backed up doesn't mean they're not going to continue to throw the football. They threw an incompletion on first down, but they came right back on second down and threw it again. And this time they hit it for not just good yardage, but a first down. A good gain of nine before he's brought down at the 28. That last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable second and one. And again, it's Mahomes. He's got it to Williams. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. A couple of first downs have him to the 40 now on first and 10. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. As his old brain remembers, when I see five wide receivers on the field as a defender, I know the ball's coming out high. They expected it and got there and popped it free. So second down and 10. Once again, they'll go from the 40. 
Mahomes firing complete. And they're going to have another first down here as the tackle's made at Washington's nine-yard line. 44-yard line. 15 yards on the play. First down. Mahomes able to find Robinson. And he just falls short down at the one-yard line. That's good. A big play there for KC. 43 yards. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. And that's caught. It's Kelsey. Touchdown, Kansas City. A one-yard touchdown pass. And the Chiefs have taken the lead. Now Mahomes to the line as the Chiefs are going to go for the two-point try. They'll look to run for it with Williams. And he is into the end zone to bump the lead up two more. Boy, I guess they're going to keep trying to put the pedal to the metal here. They're going to try an onside kick. And this is going to be covered up by Washington. A second quarter onside kick there that failed. Is that something that maybe they had dialed up before this game started? It feels like it, doesn't it? That they thought they had the right situation, you know, and, and the right approach in going after it. Also, it may signal that they feel like they have the superior team, that they can try these sorts of things and it won't come back and hurt them later. But Sean Breland, the one that got him down. No gain on the play. Second and 10 at the Chiefs' 44-yard line. We've hit the two-minute mark of the second quarter, 14 to 7. A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. Now a deep ball there on second down, but it'll wind up incomplete. Was trying to get it to Terry McLaurin. And that takes us from second to third down. They come up to the line now facing a third and ten after the incompletion. Haskins will throw. Now they go screen. It's complete. And he's going to get this down near the 30-yard line. It'll go as a pickup of 14 and a Washington first down. On first down, here's Love. So a nice job to break the one tackle, but not much daylight after that as he's brought down. On the tackle. Three yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. Up second and seven at the 27-yard line. Running the sweep with McLaurin. And he stopped immediately there. Receiver. No gain on the play, and it's going to bring up a third down. No gain on the play, and it's third down. Third down, here's Haskins. Letting one go deep for the end zone. And that is caught. Touchdown, Washington. Touchdown, Washington. Adrian Peterson, 27 yards. And Washington now an extra point away from tying this thing up. And we've got a good one brewing. We're all knotted up at 14. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. Tyreek Hill on the return. And not much happening on the return as he'll get this to about the 23. The Chiefs take over first and 10. KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And we're under a minute to go here. What's been an even first half all tied up? Yeah, still time to make something happen, too. A couple completions to string them together. Could get in the field goal range. Let's see what happens. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with just under 30 seconds to go in the first half. Ten at the 50-yard line. From midfield, here's Mahomes. And going deep for Hill. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. He was looking for Tyreek Hill that time, but it's going to be second down. I like the thought process there. They connected on a big play, and sometimes you find the defense vulnerable. So they went for the bigger shot, went for it all on that one. This time, they were ready for it. And this one incomplete. Too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. So now third and ten. A big play to start the drive, but nothing since. Mahomes to throw once more. And this is caught by Watkins. And they're going to have another.
another first down here as the tackle's made at Washington's nine-yard line. 29-yard line. Great way to convert on third down there. 21 yards the play. It's complete to Williams. That was signal and a timeout call. As it comes with nine seconds to go in this first half of play. Second and five at the 24-yard line. Five yards remain on second down. Again, they'll throw with Mahomes. And that will be incomplete. Four ticks left here on the clock. Watkins, the intended receiver, and it's third down. Not time enough for a play and then a timeout, you wouldn't think. So with four seconds left, they're going for it. Final shot before the half for Mahomes. Into heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. Sean Davis with a pick. And he will be brought down as time is in. Charles and I return after the break. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. And ready to get the party started for the second half. It was an even first half, all tied on the scoreboard. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. First half showed us some pretty good offense. Tie game, we'll see what the second half brings. And it'll be interesting because I think both sides feel pretty good about what their offenses are doing. Gotta wonder what adjustments are being made defensively to try and get a spark and maybe slow down the other side. But here, do you change up anything on this opening drive? Not offensively, you don't. You've got everything going your way. You've probably prepared for maybe some change-ups you might expect, but overall, you like what your game plan showing you. They stick to the ground game on first down. It's Williams. Through an opening, and there he goes. Oh, boy, you ain't got no feet. And a touchdown. Damian Williams, 81 yards. And the Chiefs have broken our tie as they take the lead. Well called, well blocked, and then he just made a great play. That was an athlete going a long way. Yeah, how about the suddenness, too? Just getting there and taking off and going for the defensive guys. Plays like that really hurt. Pulls it in at the 13. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. At their own 29-yard line. Out there, set and ready for this next drive, the Washington offense. And this game was all square at halftime, but now they find themselves down seven following the opening drive touchdown here in the third quarter. And they need to take a good, relaxing, deep breath, don't you think? Because right now, they might start to feel like they've got to play catch up here and start matching them point for point, but it's still too early to get there. They can still run their offense, plenty of time to get back in this game. Back to the ground. This time it's Peterson. And he'll be tackled at about the 35. Peterson, the Washington ball carrier. You know what really fires up offensive linemen? When the guy that is carrying the ball behind them can create his own space and break a tackle along the way. From the gun, Haskins on third down. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's love. And he will lose yardage back to the 34-yard line. It'll be a loss of a yard, and that's going to make it fourth down. Haskins not coming to the sideline. They're going to go for this. They'll indeed go for it with Haskins. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. Picked off here by Anthony Hitchens. And his guys are going to get the football at the 37-yard line. Well, the timing is everything on a route like this. He tried to drive that football into a tight spot. And if you're a little early or a little late, chances are there's going to be someone there. And sure enough, 
This one's going the other way. Now a throw for the All-Pro Kelsey is complete. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Give him 13 yards there and a Kansas City first down. Looking to throw is Mahomes. And the coverage terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. Nicole Hardman, the intended target. And now it's second down. At the 24-yard line. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. His throw caught right around the six. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. For a Kansas City That, I believe, will put him over 100 yards receiving for the game. Yes, it will. And he's got a first. And that'll be caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. Demarcus Robinson. Touchdown. Demarcus Robinson. His second touchdown of the night. And the Chiefs add on to their lead. In order to lead in a game, you're going to get plenty of contributors, but that's his second touchdown catch of this game. He's one of the key guys in this one. And you better believe he'll be looking for the hat trick here as this one continues to go. And this is going to be covered up by Washington. The risk-reward of the onside kick. When you don't get it, the risk comes out to play, and here they gave up great field position. And that's the key to everything because you're trying your best to press advantages when you have them. And field position leads you to that type of play calling. And whether you want to blitz or whether you want to throw the ball deep, those types of things, now that they've given up that type of field position, the advantage has switched to their opponent. Second and four. Here's Peterson. And the lane closes up quickly as he'll get about three down to the 38. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Brings up third down. From the gun, it's Haskins. And he fires one, but incomplete. Trying to get their tight end involved finally. That's the first time that they've looked his way. He's kind of been a forgotten man in this offensive scheme. Yeah, it didn't look his way at all in the first half. And I'll bet you the offense coordinator made a note at the half and said, let's get him involved because he could be a big-time playmaker for us. Gets it out quickly here to the left flag. And he'll be out of bounds about a half to a full yard shy of the five. Wow, first and goal, and defensively, all they can do is shake their heads. Not only did they allow the conversion, but a big play as well. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he is in to the end. Second touchdown of the night. And Washington able to make this a close game again. He's got it, and they're back within a touchdown at 28-21. Chiefs, 28. Washington, 21. This game back with it, a touchdown now as the kickoff's away. Fair catch called for and taken just inside the 10-yard line. The Chiefs take over first and 10 at their own nine-yard line. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And their lead cut in half by that touchdown a moment ago. They are up seven as they begin this drive first and 10. And he'll get it up to the 12-yard line here. To Travis Kelsey. Three quarters in the books. You are watching the NFL on EA Sports. We're back now in KC. Washington. It's the Chiefs with the lead and the football here as we get set for quarter number four. On second down, Williams. And he'll be taken down at the 18. It's a five-yard gain, but they'll still be a yard short here with third down now looming. That's a gain of five. Brings up third. And he finds Seals Jones complete. And he almost gets this to the 30, taken down about a yard shy. It's an 11-yard pickup. Thought they'd run it on third and one. Not the case. Now a first down carry. It's Williams. They give him four yards there. It'll be second and six. He's taken down at the 33-yard line. 
Four yards on the play. To throw on second and six. Mahomes. And that'll be incomplete. Took a pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. Couldn't hang on third down. Charles, thinking back to what you said in the first quarter, that part of the magic elixir for a road victory for these underdogs was going to be winning the turnover battle. Well, they only have one right now. Look at the scoreboard. Yeah, not exactly playing to the form that I subscribed, right? When you talk about winning that turnover battle, that evens things out, especially for a road team, especially for a team that's an underdog. Williams. That one good for 10 yards. And that'll bring up a second and just about a few inches here. Options galore here, second and a few inches. Mahomes complete to his tight end, it's Kelsey. And they're gonna have another first down here as the tackle's made at Washington's nine yard line. 39, a gain of 13, it's a first down. Now Mahomes throw complete to his tight end, Kelsey. A good pick up there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Clock continuing to run. They'll probably wind this all the way before snapping it on second down. The 30-yard line. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. Picked off by Ronald Darby. And he returns it up just shy of the 20 to the 19-yard line. At their own Out there, set and ready for this next drive, the Washington offense. The interception sets them up with an opportunity to erase this fourth quarter deficit. And this series could very well determine our outcome. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. It's now second and six at the 23-yard line. Out of the shotgun, Haskins. And he's going to find his man out of the backfield. That's complete. And he will get enough for a first down, and that will lead us to the two-minute warning. It's a six, six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. Washington. So it's Washington with the football here as we welcome you back. They come up on a first and ten, desperately needing a score here on what could be their final drive. Across the 30 to the 31-yard line. Derek Nadi makes the tackle. Not in a position where they absolutely have to rush right now, but they definitely have to pick up the tempo a bit. They'll look to throw. And he's got his man out of the backfield. That's complete. And he'll bring it up here to right at the 40-yard line. That one, a first down pickup of eight. An eight-yard pickup. Obviously a big first down right there. Yeah, they still got to hustle. They got to get up to the line of scrimmage and get set. But I don't think necessarily you need to spike it. But they've got to continue to move quickly. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. He was and Washington now going to use the first of their three timeouts. As he'll get a chance to talk it over after picking up the first down. The drive continues as they search for a tying touchdown. Here's first and ten. A carry now for McKissick. And he's got this down to the 35. 11 more on that one and another first down. And remember, field goal does them no good in this situation. You got to think they should be taking some shots for the end zone soon. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and ten. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. I know they got a little yardage there, but I'm not sure their investment is right. They're still running the football, and I'm not sure there's enough time to continue to do that. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. Now Washington going to use the second of their three timeouts as they stop it with 22 ticks to go in the fourth. into his left and that is incomplete down to 15 seconds now he was looking for Trey Quinn that time but it'll be second down at the 23 yard line and once again they'll go from the 23 yard line on second and 10 back to throw 
And that'll be incomplete with 11 seconds remaining now. And for Terry McLaurin, incomplete. It's third down and 10 yards. Big play coming up. Here's third and 10. I would expect to see some pressure here. On third down, here's Love. And he takes it down to the 10-yard line. And the clock will now stop as a timeout is called with five seconds left. yards. And the Washington first down. So not quite a first and goal. It's first and 10 from the 10. One final shot for Haskins. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. He was looking for Trey Quinn that time. And that'll bring up second down. It's now second and 10. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and 10. And he is into the end zone for a Washington touchdown. Thaddeus Moss finding the end zone on the game's final play. And Washington now an extra point away from tying this thing up. And we are tied. It's a little teaching moment here. Overtime rules. Remind us how this goes, partner. Okay. So in the And look at this. They're going to try an onside kick to begin overtime. And this is going to be covered up by Washington. So they went with the ultimate element of support. there try the onside kick to start OT and it backfires not just element of surprise how about element of hubris I mean that is unbelievable because the odds of getting an onside kick are small to begin with and to give up your opportunity to ever possess the football that way if you don't get it that is absolutely huge didn't work but boy, what a gamble and he'll lose yardage on the play back at the 45-yard line. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. Behind the chain, second and 13. First throw of overtime for Haskins. He'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. The 20. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. That one covers 29 yards. First down. First down. On first down. Love. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Damian Wilson in on the stop. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. Second down, here's Haskins. Looking for his running back, and he's got him. 
And he maybe makes it back to the line of scrimmage. That's it. No pass complete, but no gain. No yards. Yeah. So you file that as unsuccessful. Yeah, you do, don't you? Except on the stats. Throw the ball. Get a completion. You get a catch. Yeah. But still, no, no yardage. yardage. Okay. And he'll wind up losing yardage here back at the 21-yard line. Oh, we're always talking about the athleticism we see from these guys on the field. How about the intelligence as well? He recognized that there was a screen pass on that one, broke off his pass rush, and got back to tackle the running back. That's great scouting and great reaction. They're able to put three on the board here on the opening drive of OT and now up to their defense to try and see if they can hold this one. I like how you framed it up because obviously this game is not over, right? They go down and kick a field goal, then we head to sudden death. But if the defense can hold, take the ball away, turn it over on downs, this game's over. And he'll be stopped up at the 25. At their own 25-yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. The field goal would push it to sudden death. We just saw the field goal on the other end, but I don't think they are thinking field goal. At least not to start this drive, they're not thinking field goal. No. And now look at him go. 20. They are not ready. And he's into the end zone for the touchdown and the game winner in OT. With you in this one. I got some overtime, a little whipped cream on top. Look at you, trying to make this whole thing palatable. I just want you to pay for my meal later. Hey, you really just wanted four quarters <laughs> what you wanted, but how much fun was that? We had that type of a game where we got us to overtime, and then we got the dramatic ending to finish things off as well. What a game. So that'll do it for my partner, Charles Davis, and the best darn crew in the industry. I'm Brandon Gaunt, and this has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. The Chiefs victorious here as we say so long from Arrowhead.